Raven Druid, come on, we did a Raven Druid. We did a Raven Druid. He had to die. He had to die. Without finding uh, those runes, we were just going to be in a world of hurt. I don't like summoner speedruns? No. <laughs> summoner speedruns are horrible. Evil beware. What up, Nate? I love that you are here hanging out. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. Barb has done me so well in the past. I do hold all of the Barb records. Barb is my uh, specialty. Agent, thank you for the follow. He is my specialty. However, um, we, uh, yeah. He, is, he does take a while and he requires so much stuff so much stuff. I need Tal Tal Tal. Tal Eth Ith L Eth Rao Rao Tier Tier runes from the tower. And we can maybe pass up the Tier Tier runes. Everything else is required though. What about Hardcore Hell? I do not have the Hardcore Hell Barb. We'll have to try again this weekend for that one. Mr. Baba. Well, there you go, boys. Hopefully that's enough gold. Pleasure, Toast. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to Mama's Army. What, is, what a Lady Gaga song. This is Command and Conquer right now. Whoops. Amazed that you know how much of this spear in this game. Uh, yeah. Team Stark, thank you for the follow as well. I have been speeder in this game for about a year and a half. Um, and so I have, and that is through every character, through everything that character could do. Um, so I've done a lot of speedrunning, a lot of studying of the game uh, to kind of learn more about it, whatever it is, right? Um, so all sorts of random facts and things that you would never know. Uh, that, you know, and, and you'll pick, like, I'll, I'll mention them throughout the stream. I'm not like, yeah, you'll never know, haha. -ha. But just things that you like. I mean, I played this game before I started speedrunning it. Yeah, a year and a half speedrunning, but I used, I, you know, I played this game all the time since it came out. Such a great game. Um, and so, and, and, and when I started speedrunning, I learned so many things. I was like, I've played this game before, but it's as if I've never played it before. That's what it kind of feels like. That's what it kind of feels like. Yep, exactly. Ooh, I'd rather have the jewel. Um, craziest random drops I've gotten in a run. I found Viper Magic a couple times, which isn't crazy crazy, but it's still very nice. I found Titans twice, neither time on the Amazon when I was running, unfortunately. I have found a Jaw Rune, which is a high rune. I will be going back to SGDQ, or I don't know about HGDQ next year, but I was at HGDQ prior. I'll be going to SGDQ in the summer and running the Druid there. Um, let's see, what else? How was I missing? Oh, okay. I have found... I didn't think. I haven't found the most crazy of things during my speedruns. The jaw rune was by far the craziest thing I have found. And also the most worthless because it's required level 67 and you only speedrun to level 61, which is the lowest minimum that you need to beat the game. Um, so, uh, it really is like, I was so sad because I just had a jaw rune and no purpose for it. That was on my Amazon as well. So, um, that was unfortunate. Hello. My One of my competitors finds things like every run, so we give him a lot of crap for it all the time. He found He's the one who actually found uh, the javis, Javelins, F Titans, not F, um, just Titans, which are better than F in normal. He's the one who actually found Titans. 
on single player um, during one of his Amazon speedruns. So he holds the speedrun record. He took the record back from me. I got the hell or the uh, hell Amazon record, and literally the next day he runs the hell Amazon and gets Titans, which is the best item you could ever ask for in that run, and then proceeds to womp my time because, well, he had Titans. So it gives like 30 faster run walk and plus four to Java skills and you know, you know how it is, all that stuff. You need to practice early for the, practice for the speedrun starts quite early. I have been practicing. Why are non-eth better? Yes, you don't have to wait for replenish. You can just take them back home and repair right there. Nate Gallagher, thank you for the follow. So that is going to be uh, the wrong way right there. That is going to lead us to the burial grounds. And you can tell because it is in the corner of the map. I am looking for... So the exits are either in the corner or straight on. I am looking for straight on. Corner of the map will be the wrong way. This is in one of the center of the maps. Thus it will be the right way. Isn't there plus five blues? Uh, probably, but it's not going to have all the plus damage and the replenish and uh, all of the whatever stuff on it. Like, the replenish is also amazing. It's also increased quant quantity. Mega long ding dong. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Um, current world record for the hell source is like, or hell Amazon's like 757. I think my time is like 840, something like that. Like, which was a good time until Titans existed. It's gonna be a very tough one to beat, boys. Do you play Diablo 3 at all? I do not. I do not. But yeah, the plus quantity is also amazing. Um, especially in that speedrun. Because with the plus quantity, that's going to allow you uh, a little bit more, like, you don't have to go to town all the time, right? That's kind of the big problem. Is I constantly, constantly have to go to town. I should have dragged Dragonich over here first. That was my bad. Constantly have to go to town to keep repairing my javelins because they only have 60 javelins each. What not. So it saves that time. It saves time having to farm for 30 IAS javelins. Um, it is quite good. So. I am overburdened. That worked for me. Are you going to play Fire Source? Nope. I'm going to play Light Source. You play light and then move into cold. What up, Jackson? How's it going, bud? Play light, then move into cold as the game progresses. No worries, man. Brave little lover, thank you for the follow. Oh, jeez. So these are great groups right here. These little champion groups are amazing because all of those little dudes are worth 300% experience. Every single one of them, which is beautiful. Beautiful. Do they have open world PvP? Um, in what? D2? And there's PvP all over. That's a big piece of it. If you're talking about three, they have PvP. Something like it. Said I don't really play at Gash Boy and Alibabino. They get the follows. I don't really play. Uh, much Diablo 3 by much I mean at all not to say it's not terrible but are you allowed to restart client to reset mobs yes yes you are that is actually a very important thing that you will see uh, coming up soon is when I get to the tower um, I'm going to be resetting my runs oh no bad maps bad maps Brutal. Brutal maps. What you gonna do, man? Grawler, thank you very much. For the follow. Um, tough maps. But yeah, I'll be resetting my runs to reset the mobs to get better runes in the future. I made the chat on stream a larger font. Uh, yes, it's different now. I'm now using Night Dev because it no longer can, like, capture or whatever. So it's better. Do I have a couch crew? 
presumably with all of the charts. I actually know all the charts. I ask a lot, but like, there's only like three charts that I need to know, so. And when I'm just running the druid, I'll just remember them. I mean, it's, not, it's not too bad to remember. Um, but yes, Jackson will be on my couch, and Mrs. Llama will be on my couch. Maybe a couple other people. This is at SGDQ, by the way. What's the average level by the time people clear bail? Uh, it depends what character you are talking about. For Sorceress, every, well, okay, average level, everybody's going to be level 21 when they when they uh, kill normal bail and level 61 when they, when they kill uh, hell bail. Those are always going to be your values. The reason is because those are the lowest required. Um, if you're higher than that, you have spent too much time farming and didn't optimize well enough with your experience. Ryu is not going to SGDQ. No. But maybe HGDQ. Maybe HGDQ. 58k? Dang. Nice. Jack's mod's game tonight. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, so right now we just start trying to find the waypoint, and which we have, and now the tower. We have one shrine there. We want to pray for no river. As you can see, God heard our prayers and said no. <laughs> Did not work. Rip. We got the river, boys. Come, Luke. Thank you very much for the two dollar donation. <laughs> Let me get some love in the chat. It's me, bitch. <laughs> okay, now I don't. Okay, we got uh, we got the tower though. We got the tower. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. Um, I don't know. Why I didn't read it. I don't know. Why I didn't read it. Israel stats and Titans. R I P. Rip, 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 rip. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, exactly. It is very good. Really could not tell you why. Uh, and one can everything as well as well. So, um, the reason that river maps are so terrible is if it's on the other side of the river, I am just going to have a very, 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 very bad day. That is why. What up, Mario? How's it going? Inversion, thank you for the follow. Um, how's it going, bud? Yes, so we have... Darn, hoping for a boss group there. We will be uh, front page Tuesday nights for a little bit. To those who are hanging out there on the front page, feel free to come join us in the chat. We do have a good time over here. I like to think so, at least. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Um, I do have an open Discord as well. And there's my Twitter and whatever information. Nice timing, bot. Nice timing. Um, but yeah, I have an open Discord, so you can ask any questions from there, whatever it is. Oh, jeez, I hope I don't die to cold enchanted archers, which are one of my nemeses. It's the worst. Southern Tides, thank you for the follow, bud. go. Woo. Yeah, I will be doing Q&A for, uh, for a little bit of this, it looks like, because a lot of people aren't exactly sure what Diablo 2 speedrunning is, um, and hopefully I can help enlighten everyone's nemesis. Hopefully not. Uh, what's the best item for a source speedrun to drop? Oculus is quite good. Kamaluk, thank you very much for the donation, bud. Can we get some love in the chat for Kamaluk? Oculus is quite good. It's me. However, alright, she's just broken now. She's just not reading anymore. I, I cannot even tell you why. I cannot even tell you why. Now she is just broken. Um, Gargity way. There you go, Gargity. The only thing with Oculus is Oculus will teleport you in the wrong direction. So that can be an issue. That being said, I would still take Oculus any day of the week. 
Um, I think Spectral Shard is also a wonderful option. Also a wonderful option. Finald and Fronts. I hear you, man. I hear you. I don't know what's going on with it. I cannot tell you what is going on with it. Uh, so if I buy and sell, like I just did right there, I now get a full maxed out... Oops. Thank goodness. Uh, maxed out... Uh, Tome of Scrolls. Scrolls of Identity. So. 1.14C is the latest. Yes, that's a health shrine. Yes, it is. Oh! That makes sense. This is a uh, red alert. Red alert. We also got that experience shrine, which is beautiful. Did I ever find Aussie Ring? Well, you couldn't find it. It was a hacked item. However, I did have multiple Aussie Rings. Yes. Oh, no, 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 no. Holy cow. Give me some life. Ouch. Yes, I did have it. Should have got more stealth potions. Wide leather armor in the inventory. I'm going to be making a stealth runeward later. That is Tau plus F. Butter, thank you for the dollar. Let me get some love in the chat for Butter. This is a test of the bot. Perhaps it will work. Perhaps it will dirt work. 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 Dirt. 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 Do. 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 Skippity. Do. D. O. P. Do. D. O. P. Do. Nothing like a little surprise Rihanna to mix it in. Looks like the bot does work, 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 work. And I see me happy there, 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 there. So much butter. <laughs> oh gosh, there's so many archers here. This is a terrible day for being a sorceress who is not that strong. That was wonderful. Surprise Rihanna is uh, one of my favorites. Okay. Thank you. Ice rings were so beautiful. Yep, and then they all went away, as they should have, but they were super OP when they existed. You don't think the song is from Red Alert? It is. It is the Red Alert 2 soundtrack. Can't forget SOJ currency. So I remember waking up one day. I remember, where were you? Where were you when SOJs were duped? I would sit at home on computer. I wake up, turn on D2, look to brother, say SOJ2 dupe. SOJ dupe, he say what? Wow. That is, uh, that was crazy. That was crazy. Nice, nice drops. Those SOJ dupes, man. They were serious business. Faster cast rate. Oh. That is our ideal. We want to open socket shield. I was trying to get a free SOJ, and then somebody was like, here you go. <laughs> They're worthless now. Everybody's got a million of them. It really was just like instantaneous though. Hitosh, thank you for the follow by the way. Can Aussie rings be made in a sea? My goodness, it's another experience shrine. That's gorgeous. That is gorgeous, boys. Remember the other day I missed a lot of dupes and boots. Yeah, oh, that's right. That reminds me. Koa makes the ball. I have to go uh, highlight that. I have to go highlight that. So I accidentally duped a bunch of stuff the other day. We're not sure exactly what happened. But I duped 
boots and rings and a bunch of things. SJ for you, one SJ for me, another one for me, another one for me. Ugh, we keep drawing the crappy boss groups though. So champions are not worth near as much as a uh, unique pack. I should say, so that's the champion pack, right? The ones that are like different colors and whatnot. Each one of those guys is worth 300% of normal experience. However, these guys, this is a unique group. Oops. Don't curse me. Um, are worth 500% experience each. Every single one of them is worth 500% experience. It's pretty broke. Pretty uh, dope. Nice, Noxor. Nice. Is duping still common? Probably. Probably. They just released this latest patch. 1.14c came out a week ago. A week ago today, actually. Um, so they just released the latest patch. Yeah, I do as well. That really is something like, if I could tweak Diablo 2, I would tweak ranged archer damage, especially early on, because it's just brutal. Um, I would tweak champion experience a little bit. And I would make melee characters have an easier time hitting things. Because right now it is a very difficult time. They're still patching D2. Can you believe it? Can you believe it, bud? Fast rate recovery is nice. But nothing I care about there. Still going strong. So it makes me feel like they're gonna have a comeback for the game, um, which I really like. So I wanna find a faster cast rate wand right there. Oh gosh, I need to sell something. Ith Tau. Okay. What up, Hentai? I know, it is crazy that they're patching it, but essentially the way it works is this. I believe that this game is going to make a comeback. Um, and my reasoning for that is because... Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, don't hit, don't hit, don't hit. Stay away from melee. My reasoning for that is because they are starting to repatch it. They have patched it three times in the last, like, two months. Um, and they patched it so it would work on, like... They like re-optimized it, fixed some bugs, fixed some more bugs, whatever it is. Regardless, they actually paid attention to it, which is the first thing that I haven't heard, you know, like the first time that's happened in a long time that they actually paid attention to it. They just released Overwatch, so I know they're kind of focusing on Overwatch, uh, but, you know, it's like maybe the HD version of Diablo 2. Wow, ring amulet amulet. I've never seen such a beautiful, oh my gosh. Craigasm. Can we get your best O face in the chat, please? For the most beautiful, beautiful Fenry Wolf and Rabbit. Thank you for the follows. Opening we have ever seen in our life right there. Never have I ever had it that good. Wow. Wow, that is sick. For those of you who don't understand why that was sick, ring Amy Amy. So. I want to find a ring or amulet that is 10 faster cast rate in this game. Um, that is like a big goal, right? Because if you can get that, it will jump me to the next faster cast rate frame, whatever it is, uh, in the game. Drew Bits and Mr. Gruntley, if it follows. And that is a very big deal. Without that, you're just going to be slow. Um, that right there just helped us out a lot. That right there just helped us out a lot, boys. That is pretty dope, because that increases our chances greatly of having found it. Which is super nice. RNG, 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 RNG. That's right. That's right, boys. I still need a two open socket helm. Would be nice. Would be nice. Don't jinx yourself into three max. I mean, yeah. Doesn't mean I'm going to get faster cast rate off of it, but I have never had that many drop off of one. Um, I 
think DJ has a better story. You're you're just asking to start a flame war, aren't you? You'll find a lot of people here do believe that though. But you are asking for trouble. You are asking for trouble. Did I just take my wand off and throw it on the ground? I was like, I don't need this garbage. Oh god. Oh god. Dodge, duck, dip, dive. And dodge, that's right, Mrs. Lama, that's right. Ah. Did not get that in. What is with the archers today? I know they're worth good experience, but I am just not a giant fan of them. DTJSP is awesome. True that. They're just very different games. Um, so a lot of people don't know this, but opening these graves is actually a very good source of rings and amulets, which is why I opened it in the first place. Yes, we did, Zukin. Yes, we did. One of these days, I should mic up Mrs. Llama. I mean, she she's over there. She can join if she wants. But yeah, those uh, little graves have good chances of dropping rings and amies, as you have seen so far. As you have seen so far. She doesn't like the, the spotlight. Was she not mic'd for Stardew Valley streams? Yeah, she was a little bit. A little bit. Tranku, Mister, who follows, and fancy mode. Oh no! Rip. Remember, I was like, I just need one faster cast rate. Well, sometimes it works like that. Sometimes the game hates you. That is all. All right, let's see what we got. Do we have two Rao runes? No. So Rao, Rao, Taleth, Tier, Tier. Rip. Sometimes that is just how the game functions. Experience? No. I want a two slot helm. Um, Yarbo Banks. Yarbo Jenks. <laughs> Sorry. A little dyslexic right there. Follow. Um, I have seen Path of Exile. Uh, Path of Diablo, yeah. Uh, it looks interesting. I, the only thing is like, why not just play Diablo 2? <laughs> that is my question. Why make it? In, I mean, it's cool. It's a very cool like feat, design feat, whatever not. But like, I yeah, just play Diablo 2. Yeah, I'm running for runes right now and Countess. But yeah, I want to open socket helm because I'm going to be putting runes in there. Uh, so I'll be putting tier runes and Rao runes for the follow. Appreciate that. Welcome to Lama's Army. Swound and Ripped. Um, but yeah, so it's just going to be putting different runes in there for different combinations. I will go ahead and move on after this run. This will be my last run. If I find another Rao rune, dope. If not, that's fine. Fishtix Lol. Thank you for the follow. Um, if I don't find that other one, that's totally fine. Because I've got Rao Rao, Tier Tier, Taleth. That's all I really need. Uh, finding another round would just help me sell things right now. That's all, so I could get some money in space. Chip Sapphire. Do I have any chip topaz? I do not. That's unfortunate. Ostracized bagel. Thank you for the follow. Some more build diversity and changes. Some of the OP stuff. Interesting. Okay. I didn't know that they were changing things like that. Could be could be cool to test out. Tom Dog and Matt all in. You as well. Welcome, boys. <laughs> Tal L L. Okay, perfect. So that's just more things to sell. I still need that helm. I still need that, honey. Thank you for the follow as well. No, and no. Goodness gracious. Tal Tal. Faster cast rate. That is a lot 
of uh, rings and amulets we have gone through without getting it, boys. It's a tough one. I'm going to put these away just for a second. And we'll go ahead and move on because that tower doesn't have great experience in it. So. Why do I go save exit every time? Because I have to reset. I have to reset all the monsters. Cool. Alright, so now we're going to go ahead and move on. Um... What am I farming the runes for? Right, so, tier tier, I am farming for mana per kill. Um, that is what those runes give, two mana per kill. And so, by getting that, I'm just going to increase my mana every time I kill something. So it makes it so I don't have to drink near as many potions. Quite nice to have, quite nice to have. The Rao runes are going to give fire resistances, and then the Tal Eth rune is going to give me a stealth rune word in my armor right there. Oh gosh, ow. That was some serious damage. So that is one thing. Um, I am under leveled. That's just going to be the nature of it. A rizzy thing for the follow. I am under leveled. That is just the nature of the game. And I am awesome. Experience range. I am going to. Uh... Sorry. I gotta like think and attack. I am kind of a glass cannon. Build. Stamina pot stack in length. Now I want to see your face in the chat right now when you learned that stamina pots stack. The first time you, you learned stamina pots stack, I want to see what your face was like. Mine was like, that was my face right there. Welcome back, sneaky. Welcome back, bud. Whoops. So that screen, that sound was me clicking off of the screen. I am running and running in windowed mode. I'm imagining there will be a lot of paga chumps in the chat. Lots of puggy champs. All right, we should have a boss group right here. Nice. They do not stack with the stamina shrine. So kind of uh, worthless, irrelevant, whatnot. In that case, MB, maybe. Thank you for the follow. Nice, nice, Mr. Llama Vape. Love it. Your stamina shrine does not erase. Um, okay, I guess it, you could say it stacks, but it doesn't like increase the duration or anything. Uh, it just kind of overwrites it. They go hand in hand together. And Matt Light. Let me give it a final. So I just want to get that level 13 because then I can get my uh, tap my tier runes working. They're level 13 required. Thank you very much, GG. Appreciate that. And Delroyd and Bangarang Rufio. To the bottom. So in this area, a lot of D2 maps actually, do I restart if I die? Uh, it depends. Depends where the death was, when it happened, blah, blah, blah. A lot of these areas um, have general sorts of paths or whatever that you kind of want to take. Um, that's very strange sounding, but essentially I know that the exit of this map is going to be facing towards the bottom left because I entered coming in from the bottom left uh, so the entrance is going to be facing towards that way. That is just how it works on this very specific map. Jail level 1. Level 2 also has that. Level 3 does not have that. Um, so very, very specific. That is complete garbage. Alright. Garbage map. Garbage map. Swerve and Irvin. Thank you for the follow. But you are going to note um, that I'm not always going to be finding the... Uh, finding it straight across, right? So I know like I want to run straight across, but it takes zigs and zags and things like that. So in this case, this map runs all the way over here. I have to run all the way down and then right there is my exit. And I can promise you that right here is my exit. And there you go. 
Level two, always going to be the same way. I'm going to run straight across. And we will see if we get a quick exit or if we get another fun, horrible map that wants to lead us on a journey. Looks like we're, we might be going on a journey, boys. Might be going on a journey. He knows the future. <laughs> That's right. You can you can learn the future. Sasha, thanks for the follow. See, but once again, straight across. It allows me to skip a lot of the map. This one, I want to run to the left of the way I come in. Thus, I'm going to head down this way. And we're going to start seeing how far uh, we need to go over this way. And we found it right there. I can tell because these double doors. Perfect. Super friend, thank you for the follow. Um, so every, not every map. A lot of maps have things like that. Um, what a blot out the sun. Yeah, it is. <laughs> wow, I really love Act 3 speedrunning. Said nobody ever. Exactly. Infant Ninja. Good follow. Uh, yeah, it is pretty, pretty miserable. So Tainteds are like one of the worst things that can happen. Tainteds are horrible. A lot of times we just skip Tainteds. Because, eh, eh, you know, do you really want to fight the Tainteds? Nah, you don't. But since we have to come back around and fight him again, we're much X. We might as well kill him. Might as well. Rural, Kanazfu, Survivor, and Frit. Good follows. Okay, we'll take this on its little roundabout. So this is one of those maps that has no direction built in whatsoever. You are simply screwed no matter how you choose to run it. It's unfortunate. I would really love a helm because I want to put my uh, runes in the helm. Okay, not this way either. Tricky map, boys. Tricky maps. These are the things that can kill your time because sometimes you can just be flying no problemo. And other times you run into these maps and what are you gonna do? Nothing. With these maps, there's no chance to figure it out. There's no like, oh, here you go. You just have to explore the entire map sometimes. Level two, I can at least have a little sense. Um, I know that I'm going to want to run right of the waypoint. I am Elvis, thank you for the follow. Is this it? Oh, waypoint. So. I found the waypoint, so now I know I want to run to the right of the waypoint, which is actually going to be down towards this bottom left. <laughs> Steal home, that's right. Uh, yeah. What items do you usually enchant or imbue? I'm going to imbue boots in hopes of getting faster run walk boots. Which is uh, lovely, lovely. And down here, we're just going to search, see what we can. Do for a little bit. Babo! Need to follow. So here's a decent minion group, worth a decent amount of experience. And they die medium amount of time. They take a little long to kill, but they're good experience. The only problem is they do like to run around a lot. So you have to kind of trap him into a corner. I will also be going home uh, very shortly soon. Oh, there's another one. All right. Let's go ahead and go home now. As I need to stock up on more mana potions right now. Thank you for the follows, by the way. And I actually want to find a helmet. Eskaiza, Buddha, John Bear, and Jeff Sosta. And Babo, I think I got you. Oops. We'll do those later. Some boots. Still no two open socket helm. That's brutal. Alvarai, I think you can follow. Still no two open socket helm. Brutal. Just brutal. But yes, I do stream Diablo 2. Uh, I stream Diablo 2 almost daily. Finally, we got one, boys. All right. All right. The fixer fan, and this never works. As well. Let's 
So that wand right there might have... Oh, 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 he's lightning enchanted. We're gonna avoid. We're gonna avoid it. That doesn't kill him. All right. Chalar and Avak. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, but yeah, we do a lot of Diablo 2 speedrunning. I'm actually gonna look at getting into some maybe Ocarina of Time speedrunning. Uh, I've got the Wii now. I'm getting it all set up with the Japanese version. Yada, yada, yada. Um, all that fun stuff. Mean dog. Thanks for the follow. People do speedrun this game. Yes. We actually have... Um... I mean, in total, there's actually a decent number who speedrun this game. Of the main, serious, competitive people who speedrun quite often, Alex 4D, there's probably three or four. Um, but there have been a lot of speedruns of this game. Dude, these maps have been brutal to me today. Brutal to me today. That is tough. That is tough, boys. That is a very, very, very bad set of jails and catacombs right there. Great, immune to lightning and lightning enchanted. My favorite. That's exactly what I was hoping for. So we will close the door on them. And now they will not come through. Which makes life here a little easier. And there's more tainted. Snowballs from very slow to very fast, good progression, yeah. Wow! Holy cow! Did you guys see that? That was uh, the most insta-give. I probably should have had that in my life. I would have survived. That was an insta-death. So that is also right there the reason why... Uh, hardcore, softcore... Yeah, not hardcore. But, like, that's one of the things. All right. You know, it's not hardcore, but why would, like, let's say I was on a world record pace run, why would I want to throw away that run on some garbage like that that's like three seconds, you know? Like, three seconds are lost when that happens. Hello. Do we really want to throw it away there? I don't know. Probably not. Probably not. At least in my books. But I do play hardcore runs as well, so I mean, I can't say I never do or anything, but... Cool. Uh, any lightning resist? No. You die, you throw it away. Yeah, so hardcore runs are one death and you're gone. So I play those somewhat, um, but I prefer softcore for speedrunning, speedrunning, because you do have... Um, stay a while and listen. Exactly, exactly. Kodrina, Alex, thank you very much. What am I doing? I need to imbue boots. Oh my gosh, you go there. Wow, that was the hardest imbue of my life. Another two open sockets, nope. Faster hit recovery, we got lightning res though, that's nice. So we have 10 lightning resistances. I actually need to respec as well. Listen fool, I don't know and I don't stream at all. For the follow. So I'm actually going to reset now. Um, my skill points. And one, two, three, four. So this kind of is where the build starts to shift a little. Oops. Okay. X, Z, C. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Any tips on how to quickly find endurance of 8 level 3 from the waypoint? Always go left of the way the way you enter from the waypoint. Always go left. That's going to be your fastest way to find them. What up, Yuri? That's going to be your fastest way right there. So here's the lovely beetles that always brighten up your day. But they are worth a ton of experience. So much experience that you actually learn to love beetles. So in the past, all of the hate that you have had for beetles, I have had as well. I always went, no, not beetles again. Beetles are terrible. I hate beetles. You will learn to love beetles. Beetles become love and life in speedruns because you need them. 
You hate them, but you need them. They're worth so much experience, man. They're just, they're absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I do hardcore sometimes, bud. I do hardcore as well. We gotta mix it up. So this weekend, I'll be doing um, a lot of Diablo 2. Tomorrow, I'll be streaming, you know, for the next whatever few days here. Um, but this weekend, we will have uh, a lot of Diablo 2. And it's going to be a ton of fun. We'll probably try and do Glorious Flail. Thank you for all. Um, we'll probably try and do... Give me the potion. Uh, like, a lot of races, things like that. I hope so, between me and Ryu and the other streamers um, of D2. So we'll just kind of have to see who all's into it, who all's up for it. But I will be playing a lot regardless. Come on, plus to Nova. Doesn't matter. Look at those resistances. Love it. Kronos, thank you for the follow. Love those resistances. And we fourth with this map, unfortunately. <laughs> and Alex, thank you as well. Alright, sweet. So, I need to find the Halls of the Dead. Done. Now I need to find the waypoint. And or the exit. Oh gosh, she's cold enchanted. No! There's no way I died to that! Rockman and Zetchen, thank you for the follows. There's no way I died to that. I refuse to believe with 24 cold resist that I died there. There is absolutely no way. That is the biggest garbage. That is the biggest garbage we have seen. Do I don't have a belt? I do. Alright. That project and clam burst. You can follow. I refuse to believe that that just happened. That was the barb run. He, we didn't find what we needed to keep it going. Silent scoop. Okay. Yeah. Barb run. We didn't. I, so in the barb run, I need to find tal tal tal. That is extremely important. Tal tal tal, because that's going to go on one of my weapons. Um. Unfortunately, we did not find Tal 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 at all, which was horrible and just awful. And what you gonna do, right? Uh, so that kind of stunk. That kind of stunk it up. But it happens. See you, sneaky. Have a good one, bud. Have a good one. Another cold enchant. Let's not have a repeat. Mike is salty. Thank you for the follow. Try and get out of his way while after he dies there, so we don't get hit by it. And Paladorn. So a lot of people um, will actually think this is easier than it is. Thank you, Danny. Appreciate that. Um, and I don't mean to say that in any way of like, yeah, I'm so good at this game. Um, but I say that because that is exactly what I thought when I watch this run. This run doesn't quite look um, as impressive, I guess you could say, uh, or as difficult as it actually runs. The first time I saw somebody um, speedrunning this game, oh, I got ultra poisoned. I can't out heal it. Sometimes you get ultra poisoned. 15% chance. It's horrible. Um, but it is, it is very easy to, like when I watched it the first time, I said, hey, the reason I got into it is because I said, hey, I could do that. That doesn't look too bad. I played Diablo 2 for a while. That looks easy. Um, and then I tried playing it. This is Red Alert. Good, good ear. And I got destroyed. And I ran a horrible time. Um, and I was like, oh, maybe I'll have to actually work a little harder at this game. than I thought. Mockingbird and follow. Uh, but the reason that it kind of doesn't feel or I would say probably look as a place, um, no crap, is because you, you, when you're watching, you're not seeing a lot of the uh, difficulties that come around from getting hit and such, right? Whenever I get hit, I get put into a faster hit recovery, and it is awful. It is just the worst thing ever. I hate it so much. You would hate it as well. 
Um, and that tends to do a lot. Of course they do A2E. Yeah, that needs to follow. Um, and so that's one of the like difficult things about the game. Uh, that kind of gets unseen, whatever it is. You could say, we found it, we found the faster cast rate. Hooray. Um, whatever it is. Is you don't, you don't get to quite feel uh, what it's like when you're just getting massacred. Thanks for the refollow A2E. Mm -hmm. So you don't get to quite see that. I think that's one thing. But it definitely is a lot of fun to get in. There is non category for non-sources. There's a category for every character. Um, I have a tutorial down below. Anybody who is interested in getting in Diablo 2 speedrunning, anybody who says, hey, I love Diablo 2, I'd love to speedrun it, I have like a 20-piece tutorial video uh, down below that I would recommend going through, and that should teach you a lot about the game. I do not play 40k, no. I th I'm pretty sure everybody has been scammed on Diablo 2 at some point in their life. Pretty sure everybody has been scammed in Diablo 2 at some point in their life. It's just a rite of passage. That's just how it is. You play Diablo 2, you're gonna get scammed at some point. The real thank you for the follow. Have you ever played Path of Exile Races? I have not, actually. I played a tiny bit of Path of Exile. Tiny bit when it came out. Man, I am just fourth way in so many maps. Getting so unlucky. First source around nine hours. Hype! Hi, Kill. Thank you for the follow. Um, but yeah. Your wind force, you got scammed out of wind force. Brutal. Scammed out of first enigma. Oh, yeah. Never tried to trade for anything? Okay. Well, there you go. Yeah, the races are basically. I've heard about them. Yeah, yeah. I just never played enough PoE, right? I played it just a little bit. It was a fun game. I thought it was nice. So here I'm really praying for beetles. A lot of cold enchants today. A lot of cold enchants. <laughs> top one, top. And someone back. I think it follows. I don't know if people even scam for the sake of getting the item so much as they love just scamming. They're like, yeah. You know, like a lot of people kind of get that high from it, I think. Where it's like, I'm better than this guy, I tricked him. Whatever it is. Amber seems to follow. Something like that, that's my guess. That is my guess, I really do not know though. All I know is I have been scammed out. It looks like we don't have beetles by the way. Which is going to hurt us in the long run. In terms of experience. Um, I got scammed out of my first character, it was very sad. He was a terrible, terrible barbarian, though, with, like, absolutely no gear. So, it wasn't like I lost a lot, but, you know, it was still sad. Nobody likes getting scammed as an eight-year-old kid. I'm at. Follow. Is he trying for a Hell Hardcore Barb right now or something? What's he doing? Oh, jeez. Later on, later on, we will. Mikey, thank you very much. Is there a world record leaderboard for this? Yeah, if you go to speedrun.com slash D2LOD, you start the timer. I love it. Um, speedrun.com slash D2LOD, you will find uh, the records. I think there might be a link down below. Oh, God, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm alive, I'm alive. Oh no! Ooh, that was big poison damage. Orange string thinks you can follow. That was big poison damage, boys. That is ridiculous. Lost Enigma as a child. Oh, just brutal. Thinking he was a Blizzard employee. Nope. Oh. Sounds about right. Sounds about right. Like I said, happened to all of us, happened to all of us as kids. Well, most all of us. Okay. What up, offense? 
No worries. Like I said, it happened to everybody, and uh, I was a child with whatever. Save you. Thank you for the follow. And everybody who is hanging out on the front page, uh, watching, I will be off the front page in about 13 minutes or so. Um, if you want to keep hanging out, feel free to pop on by into the chat. Coming out here, I'll answer any questions, whatever it is. We do have a pretty interactive chat, I like to think. I try and keep it that way. Um, generally a pretty uh, cool chat. Sometimes we have some fun, but um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know, I stream Diablo 2 most times, like I said. Uh, might be doing some Ocarina of Time speedrunning, might be doing a playthrough of like Twilight Princess or some other Zelda games. The Musu thing for the follow. Um, so different little things here and there, but for the most part you're gonna find Diablo 2 speedrunning here. Um, and whatnot, so. That's, uh, that's the general, if you enjoy it, come hang on. Come on and hang out. Hero Sword, thank you for the follow. And Choi, and Vidin as well. Bango, Headless Bogey, Dimusu, Yuli, getting witty. Appreciate it, you guys, appreciate it. Hope you guys are having great days here. Oh, crap, I actually typed it. Felner, welcome. Oh, jeez. Wow, 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 wow. Welcome to all. Welcome to all. Let's pop that up a little bit. So, having that light res from my orb is actually extremely nice. Normally, at this time, I have a. Uh... Oh, Dragon, welcome. Normally, at this time, I have a. What up, Fred? I got you. I got you. Um, a shield with topaz in it. And that gives me light resistances. But right now, unfortunately, we do not have that shield. Oh, there's our exit right above us. Little Chihuahua. Get a true. I think it would follow us. Let's be spamming the same move over and over. What do you mean spamming the same move over and over? Like, why do I keep noving? Um, because that is my damage source. I am a Nova Sorceress. Thus, I am going to be doing that. Uh, I do a few moves though. You're going to see Nova, you'll see Frost Nova, you'll see Static, you'll see Teleport, you'll see Telekinesis, and you'll see Frozen Armor every now and then. Uh, and that should be the extent of everything that I am quote unquote spamming. Um, that's just all the skills that I have. Call me a button masher. So there's actually a lot of very precise deci decisions uh, being made of what I'm choosing to spam. But, yeah. SOJ is a ring. It is a really good ring. It gives plus to mana um, by increasing maximum mana pool 25% and one to all skills. And one other thing. Doesn't seem too important right now. Good morning, Kasliof. Good morning. I gotta say, I am... No faster cast rate, no faster cast rate on it. Yeah, Bull Cathos gives life, um, which some people prefer. I like SOJ on a lot of characters because you want that extra mana. But, you know, Bull Cathos is also great, and I think some characters I prefer BK. Just depends the character, that's all. That's all. So right now we're in the Maggot Lair, which is one of people's worst most least enjoyed sections of the game. Oops, I already opened that. Let me go. Um, it is just quite terrible. You ever do this on something other than normal? Yes. So I run this through hell plenty of times. Uh, this weekend I'll actually be doing a lot of hell runs. Um, so if you stop by, then you will get to see plenty of hell runs. This has been a tough, <laughs> tough set of maps today, boys. Tough set of maps. Yeah. So I do full playthroughs of the entire game. Um, but right now we are just doing through normal. Because I do have to work tomorrow. I'm not ignoring your OMS. 4% chance to have dinner with Llama. Sorry, bud. It's 
Sorry I missed that. That was a good one. That was a good one. Kudentaro. Welcome. Gonna install D2 thanks to me. Hype. Fun Buster, thanks for the follow. Uh, yeah, I would encourage people to play Diablo 2. Um, I love Diablo 2. What rune word am I holding on to? Nothing. I have no rune words at the moment. No rune words at the moment. No way, delicious. Vertigo, thanks for the follow. I do appreciate everybody being here. Hanging out on a uh, lovely Tuesday. I gotta admit, this is definitely makes Tuesday a lot more exciting. Um, right, I guess I can talk about other things. I gotta be careful down here though. Do not want to die. So every Sunday, I do sub run Sundays. Uh, for anybody who does have the game and is a sub or a viewer with 500 or more Dalai Lamas, which are essentially what you earn just hanging out in the chat. Um, so all you have to do is join the Discord, which is anybody can join that anyways, uh, but if you're a sub, whatever not, um, or one of those viewers, you just say, I want to run, and we get you in. We have a good time. Um, we do eight-man speed runs through the, through the game. Graham, thanks for the follow. Sega City, thank you for the follow. And I actually do... Um, that's a good point, Roma. So you're saying so no cut gets taken. I actually don't mind. I actually enjoy the Twitch sub um, button. One, it's a good way for me to get more emotes, which I love getting more emotes to pump out. Um, additionally, I think uh, Twitch provides this service, right? I could not be streaming here without Twitch. Twitch is amazing. Um, absolutely just wonderful. And they provide so much. And so I, I think... Yeah, yeah, I think it's totally fair that half of sub goes to them, like, completely fair. And I encourage people, um, if you were going to donate $5 instead of sub, I'd say, hey, why not sub uh, and let Twitch get a chunk as well? Because that's my way, almost, of uh, supporting them. So... So I want to kill this boss. I'd love to be level 17. So what's nice about this boss, well, when I can static, is he'll actually stand still once he gets low enough. Just kind of let me kill him, which is really nice. All right, boys, it's Arcane Sanctuary time. Now, <laughs> now we're going to see um, the beautiful, beautiful magical bit uh yeah they don't provide free haircutting services that is the one thing i i wish they provided right mrs llama does at least what up mess my pants um so this right here is the arcane sanctuary it is random it is random so there is no way of telling which way i need to go i have to purely guess. And there's my stealth rune word, by the way. I can't use it quite yet, but it'll activate soon. Very soon, now. Um, so I could get it first way, I could get it fourth way, whatever it is. Hey, no worries, man. No worries, Ramus. And I never encourage people... Yeah, if, like, if you don't have money for it, don't. Don't. But yeah, this is this is the time for the complete randomness. So come on, darn it, not first way, not first way, right first way. Dante Dist, thank you for the follow. Gamble has been closed. Gamble has been closed. So what we do is we gamble on this, right? We 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 all place bets essentially. This is from that in-game currency I was talking about, um, and so or in stream currency, I should say, sorry. Uh, so you get to place bets on which way you think it's going to be. First way, second way, third way, or fourth way. So far, all we know is that it is not going to be the first way. How often do you play Red Alert 2? Uh, on stream, I do not play Red Alert 2, actually. I think that would be a fun, fun game to play on stream, though. 
Off stream, a little bit here and there. A little bit here and there. It, there's definitely a uh, balance of things on stream, off stream, what I play. But I would say most of the stuff that I end up do playing is going to be on stream, just because of time purposes. For the follow, Danny B. Wee. Danny Bui. Get rid of that chunk. Now we find a second one. That second one actually does nothing for us. Unless we can find... I am Terrell, thanks for the follow. Unless we can find yet another ring. Alright, let's check third way, boys. Let's check third way. So, um... Right, so it's 11.58. I will be departing from the front page at 12 o'clock. So for all of those who have joined from there, THC Pilt, give it a follow and drink. Uh, for all those who have joined from there and are not going to be hanging out further, thank you very much. For those of you who are there and want to continue hanging out, feel free to pop on into the channel. Will it do me? Find the way! Uh, you can pop on the channel as we will be hopping off that front page soon. We have fourth way to boys. Mr. Llama fourth way. So I am known for fourth waying the Arcane Sanctuary. It's just a common, common thing. Thank you very much, Deuce. Thank you all for those follows there. And welcome, welcome, welcome. I am only level 17. I cannot glitch Telly at the moment. Um, I do glitch Telly in certain places. Luck was not on my side today. Nope. No, it was not. We've had a lot of bad maps today. This is what my SGDQ run actually looks like. Or AGDQ, sorry. This is what my AGDQ run actually looked like. Everything was like this, and it was like, well, <laughs> this is just how it's going to be today, boys. Sometimes this is what happens. Sometimes this is what happens. Yeah, so glitch teleporting is, you'll notice, notice how my character shifts to the right of the screen when I open this up, right? She's no longer in the center frame. Um, so when I'm teleporting, I can actually abuse that. And same with inventory that way. I can abuse that, Richard, base. Uh, so that I teleport a little bit further. It's pretty nice, pretty nice. All right, we got the moon. We got the moon, boys. You hole. Go ahead and stock up on these. Get that. And we'll get a couple thawing potions. My SGDQ run is not a hell run. It is going to be a normal run as well. So this has also been a case of the lack of experience today. Nobody won? Nobody bet on the fourth way? Wow! Wow! Well, thank you all for believing in me. Thank you all for believing in me. Sorry to let you all down. Wow, boys! That is crazy. People still do this! Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do, bud. Let's do it. You don't know how to bet yet? You will learn, my friend. You will learn. Deuce Peck, thank you for the follow. Man, it is a rare day when nobody wins. That means house wins. That's right, I get all your dollars. <laughs> I get all your dollars. Come on now. Oh my gosh, click it. Click it. If this is 10 faster cast rate, we have made the Holy Trinity. It is not. It is insane lightning resist, though. I'm actually going to do that, because that is better for us right here. So I'm going to drink those thawing potions. You'll see that that boosted my cold resist up 50 more. So I was at 29, now I'm at 79. Deuce Peck and Wet and Waffle, thank you for the follows. And maybe those chain boots have faster run walk on them. That is going to be our hope. Come here. There we go. 
dun, 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 dun. Here come that boy. What up, GG? That was, uh... That was tough, man. That was tough. Hard to see a character not get that. We aren't even level 18 either. Brutal. We're not even uh, level 18. Brutal. Brutal. He doesn't have all of them, but he has most of them. Yes, he does. I'll stick with that. That'll work. Alright, so now we're going to go ahead and stack up on these puppies. Cool. Fail for the flail. That's right, boys. Fail for the flail. At least I was able to talk to Jiren. That's right. When I feel nervous. Um, I was definitely a little bit nervous when I was at HGDQ. I think I'll feel better at SGDQ since I've already done it once. Uh, but, I mean, there's definitely some nerves there, you know. I think that's just going to be natural. Dude, that one dude was like the ultimate block. Come on. Put that in there. Go there. Okay. The set ring. Eh, Cathins probably. It doesn't really matter. No set ring is good for a sorceress. So. Irrelevant. Irrelevant, unfortunately. That smoke sphere. That work. <laughs> Thanks, TT. So the one of the scares for SGDQ. Yeah, I did go past the skill shrine. By the time I uh, registered it and looked back, it was too late. One of the scares for SGDQ is that I'm going to not find all the runes I need. So uh, I've considered planting the runes, but I don't know if I like that. I probably won't. Right, so teleport right now is actually in a horrible place in Act 3, which makes Act 3 even worse. Um, what makes teleport alright is once you can get greater potions. Once you can get greater mana potions, you can mass teleport forever. Until that point, though, you have to do these weird, like, half tellies. And it's just so horrible. And you're always kind of, like, kind of out of mana and stuff. So you'll see once I get to uh, Act 4 and 5. Ooh, buddy. Once I get to Act 4 and 5, that things start to get better. But until that point, we're going to have to do kind of these weird telly jumps all around. So it also makes it where teleport glitching, like I was just very, very briefly doing there, kind of doesn't become near worth it because you're constantly running out of mana. Uh, so you will see me, however, killing any boss groups that's like that I come across for a little bit longer till I can get to level 20 once I'm at level 20 I do not care anymore yes this is going to be a normal run oh it was angelics okay um, cool see that yeah this is going to be a normal run um, hell runs will be coming up this weekend so there's nothing I need in the great marsh sometimes you can get a skip on the great marsh the way my maps have been going today, I'm not surprised we did not get that skip. Um, that's fine. So we're just going to teleport to the end of the Great Marsh. Hope we hit the Flare Jungle first. And don't run into the dead end. There's going to be one dead end and one Flare Jungle coming off this Great Marsh. We just have to hope. There we go. Okay, so we, we at least avoided the dead end, which is nice. So pretty soon I will be utilizing my 
um, whatever you call it, shield. This is actually a wonderfully difficult flare jungle. So it's difficult because there's a lot of these little flare guys, which are terrible, but at the same time it's awesome because these flare guys are awesome. Get rid of that. And give me that guy. Alright, now we have more fire resist. Cool. That'll work. Cool. So yeah. My chance of death goes up, but my experience gained also goes way up with these monster types right here. So sometimes you can get birds down here. Birds are pretty terrible. Um, they don't give much experience at all. And so when you need a lot of experience, you want to find something like this. You want to get like the this exact setup of bosses and whatnot is what you want. So yeah, I want to get a little bit more experience here. Um, close to level 20. I don't want to quite get level 20. I might, just because of the nature of this area. Um, but... Let's go ahead and get more mana potions. I'm going to want those more. And then I have to set this TP, and we're going to do kind of a travel back sort of scenario here. So I'll set this here. And then I'll go to move forward. And let's see what we've got. Why wouldn't I get level 20? Because level 20 is the exact level I need by the end. And I will get a little bit more experience from Mephisto, the Trav, uh, Chaos Sanctuary, etc. So I want to get near level 20 because experience gain actually falls off a lot. Thank you for the follow. Bears. Um, experience actually falls off a lot. So a couple more packs of those. Looks like we won't get them. Okay, that's fine. That's actually probably quite near perfect where I want on experience. kill everything but that boss and now I just need to find um, the waypoint so here's where I can tele glitch to get a little further and I'll get a little bit of experience down here and that should be uh, plenty so this also will lead us we know exactly where to go down here because these maps are very set in their nature, so it's always going to be this way to the left, and now this one will be to the top right, or left of the way I came in. Always going to be like that. And then the bottom maps are actually set. So these maps, we know what they are, because these are there's only like eight set maps that it can be. Okay, let's go get some more potions. How do I use decide to use Static versus Shock Nova? Uh, it really just comes down to what the boss monster is, honestly. Um, that's something that you just kind of figure out. Not always boss monster, but whatever the monster is. Um, you're just going to have to kind of figure that out, play around with it. There's another waypoint. Hopefully we have a good sewers. Sewers are random usually around the outside, sometimes in the middle. When you have very, very bad maps, you'll get it in the middle. But you just gotta kinda say your prayers in the sewers. But yeah, finding the time to use Static vs. Shock Nova is quite tricky, I would say. Like, I'll use Nova on any weaker monsters, and on any monsters that are, uh, too strong, I'll use static. 
Actually do this. Over here. Oh, I thought I got that other. Thought I got that other waypoint. Guess not. That's fine. So I won't be resetting this one. Um, even though we're going to be off. Finding all the waypoints today. We're gonna go to the Travancle. Yep, kind of practice uh, at this point a little bit. And, uh, there it is. So you can actually tell Kinesis this from down here, which is nice. And I'm actually going to go get a Merce now, in that time that it's taken for that. Uh, sure, we'll grab that guy. And we'll get a few more potions, and then we'll move on. Mephisto. I really thought that would be worth more gold than that. We are very low on money. We're going to need Mephisto to uh, pump us up, boys. We're gonna need some gold from Mephisto, otherwise we're gonna have to do the forge. Which I never like doing. Also, that is not a good map draw right there. Hmm. There it is. Okay. Tough maps are tough, boys. Tough maps are tough. And here, once again, you can see how awful it is trying to teleport with only, like, half teleport. I need mana. Oh, gosh. So he'll act as a nice little tank for us there. Perfect. Like a charm. Probably didn't want to waste all that money on these things that I just did there. And that is not going to be worth a lot. Unfortunately, everything we just found is going to be uh, pretty garbage. So that is... Yeah, I've got the Durance map learned. That is unfortunate. We might have to do Soulstone. I might. I mean, we will. That is garbage drops. Garbage drops right there, man. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Yeah, this is running versus average here. Brutal. Brutal. Just suddenly stop teleporting at that point. <laughs> that is average. Average splits. Okay, so here you can see the greater mana potions. A thousand times better for teleporting. A thousand times better for teleporting. So Hellforge takes a couple minutes. But it is a quick way to uh, gain 30,000 to 40,000. It is precious time, but I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. That is a terrible, awful forge. I need to have not those guys there. Where did he even go? I don't even know where he went. There he is. Yeah, this is uh, extremely bad. Because all these things are 
miserable to fight against. There we go. And the Might Aura does not help. The hell forge. Well then. <laughs> Woo. That's a tough one. We got it, boys. We got it. Zell Turtle, thanks for the follow, bud. Not even close, baby. Not even close. So I also don't need that, so I can just get rid of it. And there we go. That'll get us a little bit of money. Still probably want more later, even. Still probably want more later. Big chocolate links for the follow. And we have to get our Merce back. Give him a pike. So the reason I need him is for um, Grand Vizier. He is extremely difficult to kill. By the way, this is the teleport glitch that we were talking about earlier. bad boys too much crap too much crap been bamboozled chucks thanks for the follow they got rid of Iron Maiden from the game for the chaos Too many guys over there. Dead. Dead, 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 dead. Look at That's not a great place to have a town portal. Very, very, very crowded. This is one of those maps, boys. This is one of those maps where you just do not have a spare spare spot. Nowhere to go. There's nowhere to go. Woo! SGDQ, here we go, right? Yeah, things like this make it tough. She had it! She had it, boys! So we're gonna just reset that. We're just gonna reset that. Okay. Are you sure you're a speedrunner? <laughs> I promise, I promise. Literally, I mean, nothing you can do in those cases. Like, 
There's there's absolutely just no chance. Absolutely just no chance for it. That's where you just get mapped, boys. That's where you just get mapped. Alright. Alright, good thing we got Forge. Probably one of the worst chaos sinks I can have right there. I need Definitely not an ideal chaos sanctuary at all. generally a little bit more of how it what it looks like and goes down like this is a little bit more of what you're gonna generally see there you go still not great but that was a uh, that was a strange death These little storm casters do not make for a very happy llama. Too many storm casters do not make for a happy llama. I know, Will. I know. That shouldn't have happened. I'm not sure why I did. Yeah. Call a buddy, have him log in and help me out. There we go. a less crowded area. That is all. That's all I want. There we go. Alright. We're good. We're all good. By the way, I just realized what our problem was. I thought so. I thought that might be a problem, and I was wondering if I was going crazy or what was up. I really hope this is worth money. Oh, gosh. That's going to be worth serious dough. We don't have faster cast rate. I sold that other faster cast rate thing thinking I had faster cast rate, but I did not. Thus, there lies our issue. I thought that I had replaced it with something with faster cast rate. 
but I did not. So, I am now short the faster cast rate that I needed before. Oh, no wonder. No wonder. That's why I'm moving so slowly. I was wondering, I was like, man, I just feel like this is not the right, the right casting speed. And it isn't. And it is not at all. Not enough mana. Act 5 is a fun act. Not enough mana. Yeah, and I could have moved up for five more grand, but I should have enough gold to last me through the rest of it. Should have enough gold to last me. Otherwise, I definitely would have if that was like the only item I had. I can't believe I uh, messed that up. I swear that this had it. I, need mana. I must have seen the resistances. I swear that it had faster cast rate. When did I change that out? I changed that out at the start of Act 2. I think I got that from like Indariel or something, or like a monster at the start of Act 2. So I have been lacking the faster cast rate since that point. Yeah. It all makes sense. Like, it all makes sense, because I've been just teleporting so slowly thinking that I had the next frame up which is a massive difference massive difference like that chaos sanctuary would have looked very very different alright through here. A lot of D3 hate going on. No hating on the D3. Let it, it is its own game. It is its own game. That is all that needs to be said. Diablo 3 is its own game. Some people enjoy it. Let them enjoy it. Let them enjoy it. Let's trick to Worldstone level 2 and 3. 2 is going to be... Um, Rax, thanks for the follow. 2 is going to be off of the waypoint. I'll show you in a second. I mean. uh, it's going to be to the right of the waypoint. And then level 3, there is no trick. So I'm going to run it clockwise now because I probably won't find the waypoint then. And I don't want to find the waypoint. I want to just move on as fast as possible. In a hell run, I would want the waypoint there. In a norm run, I do not. Just for fun. I like to find better gear, even though I don't do a lot. Dead. Oh. So Death Lords aren't fun, but Death Lords mixed with all of the fairies truly are an awful time. Because they'll just put you into this hit recovery over and over where you can't cast anything every time they hit you. And it is uh, pretty awful. Whew. 
Ouch. <laughs> Don't die to Colenzo's wave. Don't die to Colenzo's wave. PvP was the best. PvP is fun. PvP is fun, but I really like PvM. So I need to drag these guys, but I have to make sure I drag the boss. If the boss isn't following, none of them will follow. They will all go back to the boss. That is some AI that has been built into the game, essentially. Is everybody plays follow the leader. Everyone plays follow the leader. Why do I have armor from first location? Because it's got my stealth in it. I don't really care about defense or anything. And this armor requires the least strength and or you know some really low strength whatever that I don't care about I don't want to waste any skill points in there because I'm already a glass cannon so any points that are not being devoted to vitality at this time are uh, no bueno The stealth lasts through a hell run? Yeah, a lot of times it does. A lot of times it does. Oh, Irathers, sorry. They're light gauntlets. They're light gauntlets. Irathers. Yep. So it's got 25 faster run walk, which is great. 25 faster cast rate, which is really great, especially when all of you are casting. 25 faster hit recovery, which is also great. And then the rest of the stuff, regenerate mana, poison res, you know, they're okay or whatever. But those top three stats are very good, and it's so cheap. Um, it's very clutch. And when you're just playing a a girl who is like, or a character who is a glass cannon, defense, everything like that. I mean, I have a 66 defense, you know, like, irrelevant. I cannot believe that I dumped my faster cast rate one, though, for this. I thought I thought it was faster cast rate. I don't know why. I don't know why. DMK, thank you for the follow. 